Good morning everyone. This is my first vlog, so welcome to my vlog and my vlog channel. Um, I thought that I would do these vlogs to kind of show you in and out of my life, especially work and events um, that I do. So today is a fun day. I just woke up, fed the dogs, all of that, um, and now I am getting ready to go to Curry to get my hair and makeup done um, because we're finally shooting the office. I'm going to show you behind the scenes of all of that today, uh, so stay tuned. So I just got back from Curry. They did my hair and makeup. This is why I look all glam. And I am getting ready for the photo shoot of my office space up here. Here's like a little sneak peek of what it looks like. Um, so this space used to be, um, well, originally, scratch that. Originally on the property, there was a barn, a horse barn. Um, it was very old and I just used it kind of for storage when I first bought the house. Then um, a few years ago, I had it knocked down and then we built a two car garage and then this loft space above it, which is what it is now. Um, but that loft space was kind of just like a party room. It didn't have heating or air conditioning, so you could only kind of hang out when it was nice out. Um, like in the spring or fall basically and we would just hang out and have friends up here but other than that didn't use it too much uh so when the pandemic hit and will started working from home um i gave him my office inside the house and then i was like let's turn this into an office space for peak pr because i always have interns coming and courtney's here um and lots of client samples so this gave me the extra space and i got to make it my own um if you guys would be interested in like a full office tour let let me know in the comments below and I can make that happen um, and I'll just give you a little sneak peek today and then stay tuned for the pictures um, I'm using them to update the peaked PR website with some fresh new pictures uh, and social media of course too so stay tuned okay good morning guys it is Wednesday morning now um, I am sorry I couldn't take you into that networking event last night it, everyone was talking about some of their struggles with businesses and um, some of the challenges and kind of introductions it was our first meeting so I didn't feel like I should pull the camera out um, and then today I peloton this morning fed the dogs all of that which you guys saw and then later today I have a photo shoot for a client that I have to swing by, so I'll take you along for that. And then also um, I have a podcast that I'm recording, so you guys can come along for that too. So this is my setup for the podcast recording um, for trying to do video. Normally I just record them audio, um, but I'm going to put them on YouTube as well. So I had my dad build me this. I still have to paint it, um, but it's big enough to hold my laptop and the mic. Um, and then it has little cubbies where I can store things. I always wear headphones when I'm recording. Um, and I have my ring light so that the lighting's good up here. And I just sit here now at this little blue couch in the office and record my podcast. So that's like the behind the scenes. Okay. 
tonight, Wine Still Sold Out is doing their anniversary event for some influencers. Um, it is a Zoom. So this is my little setup I do whenever I have uh, virtual wine courses. I pull the side table in front of the couch with my laptop and use the coffee table. It's just more comfortable than sitting at um, the kitchen table. So this is my setup. And then here's um, what... <laughs> I got so I got the Brunellos um, I wanted the champagnes but I wasn't quick enough uh, so this is a good second best so this is one that we're trying it's a 2016 there's Marty getting in his bed and being weirdo and then here is the other this is also a 2016 too apparently um, so I have them in glasses to decant them um, I did that like 45 minutes ahead of time and then I'm gonna hop on the zoom Happy um, Friday it is. I have had a crazy day today. Yesterday was kind of boring, so um, sorry about that. There was just the wine um, event, which was super fun, and I drank way too much Brunello, and so today I am on the struggle bus, so sleepy, um, but I had a busy day. I recorded two podcasts this morning back to back, um, had a Zoom for a client, and then did like some pitching and just some usual email stuff for work and now though um, I am on my way to see a listener of the podcast um, who's in town for a wedding and she actually is from this area to begin with uh, so she's visiting in town and she sent me the sweetest email um, saying that she listens to the podcast and it's been so helpful in um, you know relaunching her brand and she's found some great resources from it so she um, has a brand too, which I'll tell you guys more about that after. Um, but she is a brand uh, and she's working with one of the consultants here on the main line that she heard about through the podcast on my interview with Club and Court and Emily McCarthy. Uh, so that's super cool. Like I love meeting people in real life. Um, more of like a social butterfly and uh, so it's cool like meeting people in real life from knowing them on the internet uh, so I am driving there now to go and have some coffee and meet her in person which is exciting uh, but yeah happy Friday hope you guys are enjoying your day and this vlog my first vlog ever um, this week and hopefully it gives you a glimpse into uh, what it's like being a publicist um, and what I do and all of that. Okay, I'm here at Valley Forge Flowers. I'm so excited because I met Susan and she gave me this beautiful clutch. Say hi. Hi. And we got to connect. She's in town for a wedding. And we had so much fun chatting all about business and exciting things coming out for her brand. <laughs> this has been great. I've enjoyed meeting you and talking about everything. <laughs> So I just got back um, from my meeting with Susan of Millie Kate. Um, this is her logo. And she gave me a beautiful clutch, which you guys saw. Um, oh, and she wrote me a sweet note. I'll have to read that. But she makes these beautiful handbags. She started this business during COVID. Um, and she has lots of exciting things coming out that we were talking about. So some new styles and things like that launching in November and then in the spring again. Um, but this is one of her styles that you can shop on her website right now. It's just classic and preppy. Um, while we were at Valley Forge Flowers, I um, got into some trouble and <laughs> got some things for Christmas. So I thought these were so cute for the office. They're like the office colors, like pale pink and pale blue and green. Um, so I got those in a few colors. 
Um, here's the blue one and navy. And what else do I have in here? And then green. And I also got two of these green and gold ones for in the house. I just thought they were really elegant and pretty and classic and they sparkle so nicely. So I got some some fun things for Christmas. The guy working there, um, I was like, oh my gosh, you have Christmas out already. And he was like, yeah, get it now because we're not getting as much stock as normal. Like we're ordering 10 pieces and the vendor's only sending one. Um, so I like had FOMO, I feel like. If I didn't buy them, I was gonna regret it. So I did this, um, but it's probably making all of you very anxious. Uh, so yeah, it's been a fun Friday getting a lot done and um, doing that little bit of shopping while I was there for a meeting.